Hi, it's Kirstine. I was asked to demonstrate how to cut bandanas because um, I have I did a diagram, but um, they couldn't figure it out. You want to start out with fabric that's preferably 45 inches wide. So that's from selvage to selvage. This is a selvage, not to selvage, and these are the cut ends. Um, if you get uh, fabric that's 44 or 45 inches um, wide, then you want to ask for a yard and seven inches. That will give you the exact dynam dimensions that you need to cut bandanas without any leftover. First thing you do is fold it in half. This is the folded end, and then this is this called the selvaged end, and this is the end that the fabric store employees cut. Um, easiest thing to do. I'm just going to do it the simplest way. Use your pinking shears and cut your fold down through there and cut your folds uh, the lengthwise of the fabric. Um, I never am too exact. You can be a lot more precise about this. So cut again the bottom. Okay, so now we have four layers and, and we've got four squares that are that size. You want to fold it from one corner to the other corner. So you're matching up from the corner and you're matching your cut edges. That gives you the triangle shape. And then all you have to do is go to where the white line is on your fabric and you follow that white line and you cut through all your layers. And uh, depending on how strong your pinking shears are, you might have to cut these individually, but mine are pretty sharp and pretty strong, so I can cut through all, that's eight layers I just cut through. So that's garbage. Now we have four sides that are all been cut. And now we're gonna cut through the folded edge. So basically we're cutting, from now on, we're just gonna fold and cut the folded edge. Then I'm gonna take the top four because I can't go through all of them at once. I take the top four and again, so that's a triangle. I'm folding from corner to corner and that creates another triangle. And then I'm gonna cut the folded edge. Now, depending on what you like, this can be your finished bandana. Um, I actually cut it one more time because then you get a big and a small bandana. So I take it again, fold from corner to corner. This is where the fold is. These are the cut edges. Um, I get a triangle again, but I'm not cutting this line. I'm going to, on the folded edge, so this is the folded edge, I'm going to fold in half. So there's the folded edge. These are cut edges. This is where people get confused. By folding it from that edge to that edge, then I cut this folded line. When I'm finished, I then have a bandana this size, which goes on all but the biggest dogs. And what I do is I just kind of roll the edges like that and then tie it and it looks perfect. And then I have a smaller bandana that's perfect for your Shih Tzus. If I need it for a smaller dog like Toy Poodle or whatnot, um, then I can even cut it. But if you cut them this way, you can actually get 32 bandanas from a yard and seven inches. If you have any questions, just email me or whatever. Thanks.